driving on logging roads can be treacherous, and those who frequent it have been warning of the dangers for years. It is time to take a look at this, not just for Banfield. Concerns over the safety of the logging road were raised 11 years ago by BC's Forest Safety Watchdog. The report identified how logging roads are no longer just used by the industry, and so they should be maintained far better. The maintenance and the construction of your road is entirely at the mercy of the resource industry. When things are good, maybe it's maintained well and, and, and it's fine. But once the industry starts to go into any kind of downturn, your road goes to hell in a handbasket. It's a problem felt by other remote communities across the province who rely on logging roads to get in and out. This sign in Tassis using humor to warn of the dangers. But joking aside, residents rely on Facebook groups to find out whether the road is safe for travel. We have some really tight curves that are places where people often slide off of the road or, or even roll their vehicles. And uh, you know, this, this, this is what we have to deal with. The recommendation from the report in 2008 was to give these roads a new designation to ensure someone is responsible for their upkeep. Define what that will be and then be responsible to ensure that whoever it is that's managing that maintenance or construction is living up to those commitments. The Ministry of Transportation says it is looking into the issue to determine if safety improvements can be made, but it says the matter is complex given that these roads are privately owned by forestry operations. The Ministry's response, while true, isn't good enough for those who live in these remote communities. And they're hoping the deadly accident in Bamfield serves as a wake-up call. Tina Lovegreen, CBC News, Vancouver.